Okay, the way this tensioner works on your machine is this pin that goes in, when the pin is pressed in on the end like that, it pushes this plate away and the, the tension discs free up so that the thread can go in there. And then when you release the pin, it gets tight so it has tension. So when you put the tensioner in the machine, Inside of that hole is a little finger, a little plate, that when you lift the presser foot up, when you lift the presser foot up, it pushes out like this in order to push the pin out to release the tensioner. So what you do is you put the pin in, or in the case of a needle, you put it in and you make sure that's protruding out a little bit maybe like um, a centimeter or something. Every machine is a little different. And then you put it in the hole and when you raise the presser foot up, see how the tensioner pushes out? Well, that's what it's supposed to do. So you lower the presser foot, you push the tensioner in, and then you tighten the little screw that holds the tensioner in and then when you raise the presser foot, it doesn't push the tensioner out, it releases the discs. So you got tight tension discs here, and then I raise the foot, and now they're loose. So that's the correct way to get it in. So what you have to do is, A, first of all, figure out which direct, where this is going to be, and the check spring is important. So you want to make sure that the check spring is in such a way that it's probably about in the, say, 10 o'clock position, maybe something like that. Lower the presser foot down, push the, pre push the tensioner all in, all the way in, make sure that this is in its position, then tighten the screw on the side to hold the tensioner in place. And then when you raise the presser foot up, it should release and then snap it tight. If it doesn't work, if it does, when you raise the presser foot, if it doesn't release, then your pin is either the tensioner isn't pushed in far enough or the pin is too short. So then you have to take this out and get a longer pin. Whoops, I didn't loosen it enough here. You have to get a longer pin, okay? This pin has to be a little longer. If the pin is too long, then what's gonna happen is the tensioner may be sticking way out and it may not work properly. So you've got a little bit of wiggle room in there, but that's the main uh, concept behind the whole thing.